Losing weight, counting calories, counting macros, keeping track of your body fat measurement can be incredibly difficult. It's the reason why so many people quit their weight loss journeys. But we don't live in the middle ages anymore. We have technology, we have phones, we have apps that will help us get to our body composition goals. And today we're gonna talk about one of those apps, the best macro tracking app on the market, Macro Factor. If you've been around these parts for a little bit, you know that about a year and a half ago, I did a Macro Factor video. If you haven't seen that one, check it out. That goes over more of the standard operating procedure of Macro Factor. Today's video is gonna be about some of the newer features that I really like and that really cement it as one of the, if not the best macro tracking apps on the market. First up, my favorite newer feature is the ability to track micronutrition. I know it sounds weird. The app's name is Macro Factor. We're talking about micronutrition, but I think it's incredibly important as you move away from just trying to lose weight to more so having a balanced diet that is going to get you as healthy as possible. So what's the difference between macro and micronutrition? Macronutrition is your calories, your protein, your carbohydrates, and your fats. That's what we all think about when we think about tracking nutrition. But if your world evolves outside of just the gym, also understand that micronutrition, meaning minerals, vitamins, fiber, things that we as gym heads don't really think about play a huge role in your overall health and your longevity. So with this fact in mind, Macro Factor has added a robust ability to track micronutrition. You can get really in the weeds with some of the detail in your micronutrition. You can go down to individual amino acids tracking how much you're getting on a day-to-day -day basis. Now, in the hands of a newer dieter, a newer person who is just coming into their own with nutrition, this can be a little bit dangerous. But as you continue to grow and as you continue to become more experienced in what your body needs to function at its best, having this information is invaluable. You can understand pretty accurately how things are being manipulated based on what you are consuming on a day-to-day -day basis. Don't get caught up in the weeds here. If this is not something that you think you are capable of understanding just yet, that's totally fine. At its surface, Macro Factor is a macro nutrition app. You will be able to lose the weight that you want to, to gain the weight that you want to, to focus in just on your macronutrients if that is what you want. But something that I like as someone who is going on to their sixth year of using tracking apps and dieting is getting this granular information so that I can really, really dial in my nutrition. Since we're on the topic of data collection, my second favorite newer feature in Macro Factor is the ability to track every bit of body composition data that you could ever want. There is now built into the app the ability to take progress pictures, the ability to track measurements of all parts of your body from left forearm to right quad, you can do whatever you wanna do. And as you build that library of measurements and data, you get a clean, slick UI that just allows you to see at a snapshot the progress that you have made. This is invaluable because as we talk about on this channel, dieting is a mental game. Losing weight, gaining weight, trying to change your body composition is a mental game. If you do not have the physical, tangible evidence of the changes that you have made at your fingertips, it becomes very easy to begin to lie to yourself and to begin to say, you know what? I'm really not making the changes that I thought I was. I think I'm gonna just be done with this whole dieting thing. It's really not worth it. Having this data in front of you is invaluable with keeping you on the path towards your body composition goals. You have to really take stock of whether or not you want to utilize this feature because as we talked about with the micronutrition tracking, this can be something that you can get lost in, that you can really go deep into the weeds in and hyper fixate over the 0.1 inch that you've lost on your left bicep. That is not what this feature is for. This feature is for a snapshot of the progress that you have made. It is not something that you need to really dial into and get in the weeds about because in my experience as a nutrition coach, that is a one-way ticket to getting you over-obsessed with your eating and unfortunately getting you on the path towards disordered eating. We have to have a healthy relationship with all of these apps, but especially apps that are gonna give you this much data. Data can be incredibly powerful if you're using it in the right way. If you instead use it as a way to fixate and over analyze, I think you're on the path towards destruction. Finally, the best thing about Macro Factor is that it is an evergreen and ever present app. The people that developed this app 
are continuing to make improvements. Some of the macro tracking apps on the market right now are kind of set it and forget it apps. They built you a good food database. They built you a decent way to track macros and calories and they said, have at it. This is it. We're not gonna evolve with the times. We're not gonna make any major improvements. And that's totally fine. I think those apps still work but nutrition science continues to evolve. The areas of nutrition continue to get better. I prefer an app that continues to change with the times. You can look on the Macro Factor website and they have a list of goals that they want to integrate into the app in the future. Some of my favorites, sub goals, meaning you set up your weight loss goals of 50 pounds, that's a huge goal. Having the ability to celebrate sub goals of five to 10 pound weight loss can be invaluable, again, with keeping you on the path towards weight loss. I think that's gonna be fantastic when they get it coded into the app. They also continue to add more and more educational pieces to the app. The app can be great, but as we've talked about, there's some danger in just giving people data. They are committed to making this the most educational diet app, as well as the most functional, which I think is pretty invaluable. And honestly, it's well worth the price tag of 89 bucks a year. You can get it on almost any sale or influencers code to get it a little bit cheaper, but it is truly worth it. It's one of the best apps I've used. It, it's helped me lose 50 pounds, 70 pounds. It's helped me gain weight. It has just helped me gain a little bit more control over my nutrition. And I think that's invaluable and I hope you do too. So that's Macro Factor. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't seen the original Macro Factor video I did, click on it right here. It goes over more of the baseline of the app, the reasons that I fell in love with the app in the first place. Give it a watch, get a little bit more info. Thank you so much for watching this video. It means a lot that you clicked on this one. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and do so. Send the video around to some of your friends and I'll see you in the next one. Get strong and stay strong.